through a schnauzer facebook page and i saw that they had taken in a paralyzed schnauzer and after having had neck surgery i was like oh my gosh i want to meet this dog i share something with him cobb was found crawling in the median of an eight lane highway in cobb county georgia and Schnauzer Love Rescue stepped in and said, we'll take him, we'll put him through rehab, we'll get him a foster family and see if he can be rehabilitated and adopted. He was in a pen in this foster family's house and I went right in the pen there, sat down with him and he was just crawling, uh, along crawling all over, which I guess was unusual with what his foster family had said. There was definitely a connection and I don't know what it was, but this little boy stole our hearts. So I started fostering with the other foster mom. I just knew that this dog needed to be taken care of. Oh my God, that is amazing. He's doing so much. So we had a veterinary neurologist. He has a physical therapist. He had acupuncture. He had laser therapy. With a dog in his condition, you don't get a manual on how to take care of him. Early on, I thought, oh my gosh, how many more days am I going to have to do this? This is a lot. But he's got the kind of personality that you get past all of that. Cobb gets a lot of water in his food to help prevent UTIs. A lot of water. And the more we participated in his routine every day, the less overwhelming it became. Okay, can you help me with his legs? Okay, come on, here's the salad. Mr. Salad. Rehab put him in his wheels for the very first time. And it was like he grew his legs back because he just took off in the wheels. And you could see the look in his face, like, oh my gosh, I can walk again. It's like he knows when he has his wheels on that he gets to be a dog again. I was the last person to think that we would adopt. You know, I kept saying, no, no, we're not going to adopt. We're just fostering. We're just fostering. And the whole world knew we were going to end up with him. I was the last to know. He just sucked us right in. We tell everybody not to look in his eyes because you'll be hooked. I think dogs are put here to make a difference in people's lives. And this guy is killing it. I think of it like ripples in a pond, you know? It started with him and everything he does spreads out to more and more and more people. Everybody he meets, it spreads and spreads and spreads. He gives us so much love and so much happiness. There's not a day that goes by that we don't laugh at something he's done. He keeps us in stitches. He's the happiest, funniest little boy you ever met. And I'm so thankful that he's here to share his love with the world.